What is up guys? It is me, Shelton Aethe, with another video of Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. In today's video, I finally want to um showcase my Sonic presets. Yes, I never got a chance to show off my Sonic presets since Xenoverse 1 came out because I had an idea I wanted to show all my Sonic presets from Xenoverse 1 and until um, up to Xenoverse 2 with um, classic Sonic that you see in front of me till this day. Alright, so um, throughout this video you will see um, my Xenoverse 1 character um, preset of modern Sonic and all of the other um, presets he had in Xenoverse 1, which you can still do that in Xenoverse 2, except for the Z-Souls. Because um, some of the Z-Souls may be in here and may do the same thing from Xenoverse 1, but some of them um, may do differently. For an example, like I am neither Kami or Piccolo, which I think it does the same thing, but I'm not very sure because I haven't um, checked both of their um, descriptions from Xenoverse 1 and Xenoverse 2. So yeah, I also um, shaped up my classic Sonic character as well because he was towards Key Blast Supers um, because Sonic's supposed to be like a melee type or I should say balance type character for a male Saiyan body because male Saiyans can't do um, very good key blast supers. They're good with strike melees and stuff, and they hit harder. All right. So this preset in front of you, you're seeing is um, what I quote unquote call um, ultimate Sonic, or you should call it like Mystic Sonic, like Mystic Gohan and Ultimate Gohan, or Potential Unleashed Gohan. So basically, that's why I made this preset as for Classic Sonic is Potential Unleashed Classic Sonic, because if you remember in Xenoverse One. Of modern Sonic he did have this clothing on what you're seeing but I but the wig is different it was um, I will show you right now what I'm talking about without the um, wig it has it kind of res looks like my Xenoverse 1 character right so basically that's what classic Sonic supposed to look like almost like um, the modern Sonic from Xenoverse 1 but this time I have the Super Saiyan God, the Super Saiyan wig on my head to make it actually look like Potential Unleashed or Mystic Sonic and stuff like that. Or Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Sonic, which I highly doubt that would be a badass transformation to do in this game. But I highly doubt that in the meantime. So now I'm going to show you the rest of my other presets for um, Classic Sonic. So now, of course, we have normal Classic Sonic right here. And also, before I show the presets, I will show you... Um, I did shape up my attribute points, What, like I said earlier that he was towards key blast on um, attacks now I shaped him up a bit so I have 125 um points into max health I have 20 into max key which that gives me seven key bars and a little bit of it to almost to eight so I can do um, you know 500 key transformations and all like that and max 20 of stamina that's basically balanced as the same as key or Kai whatever what you want to call it and basic attacks I have it on 60 and I also have strike supers almost to 125. The reason why I have 125, or I need, well, I should have 125 strike supers into a male Saiyan because male Saiyans are not that good with key blast supers. No matter how high you set it to, they probably will do the high damage they can as possible, but they're towards more melee attacks for male Saiyans and Saiyans in general even if you're a female or male but for earthlings and other races they are possible to do that as well with 125 key blast supers 
The reason I don't have this one, 135 um, strike supers, is because I'm gonna wait for the level 99 level cap to come out. It's also for level 90 as well. So it'll be a lot easier for me to level up my character so it can be more stats of it balanced. Not to mention the um, QQ Bang as well, which it also boosts the stats as well to make it more balanced. So if you are aiming for a balanced character or any type of character, do it like I did because I made my character kind of balanced if you know what you're doing because it, it really looks like it's balanced for me like all the stats are like balanced and everything so now we are gonna test each one of these presets so I'm gonna go to an offline battle and test each one of these presets and tell you about it so you don't have to you know keep hearing the music in the background and stuff okay now, we have normal classic Sonic, and his move sets. I did had a super key explosion with this, but I switched it with Time Skip Molotov, one of Hit's ultimate moves because we all know Sonic is quick, and he has to get those fast hands in there and stuff. So I was like, why not use Hit's ultimate move? Even I know Sonic can't do Time Skip, but he did do Chaos Control in Sonic Adventure 2 Battle and also Sonic X as well, if you guys remember that, when Shadow the Hedgehog came and everything. So yeah, I have Kaioken for Sonic, uh, Super Kamehameha because it's an easy ult to pull off. Of course, we have the actual names for Sonic, the character himself, Sonic Rush and Sonic Kick. Sonic Rush is from Future Gohan. You get him, you get that move from him while training him. And Super God Fist, because Sonic is a melee person, so I decided to put that on there. Maximum Charge, because Sonic needs to charge to use those attacks. And Mock Dash as the evasive. And then, of course, the Z Soul is Kaioken. I've been saving this Kaioken, which it um, reduces uh, stamina while using Kaioken, and it gives you more key while using it. So now we're looking at Supersonic, or I should call this Sim Supersonic, which is um, a set that I made for myself in mind. Did which this one is the true um super classic sonic as in true super sonic and this one is like the sim because the um the colors you see and plus the stats have changed as well so for this preset of my character sonic is super god shock flash kamehameha super god fix yeah i said super god fish <laughs> Oh my god, that'd be, a, that'd be a nice attack though, Super Godfish. <laughs> but anyways, maximum charge, and we have, of course, Super Kamehameha, because this is Sonic's super form. And I have Justice Combinations as well, because I'm trying to have a build for my main hero, Sonic the Hedgehog, to have balance key and strike supers as well. So that's what my goal is for um, my main character I play as on Xenoverse 2 to have all my stuff balanced as possible have it all equal as well and of course Super Saiyan and before creation comes ruin which I really think that should be before creation comes destruction that boosts my key blasts um, attacks during the battle and my next preset is the I guess I you should call it full power supersonic like I said and also, these are also equipped with QQ bangs as well, just to let you know. So that's why I'm telling you the stats are changing because I use certain QQ bangs for it and stuff. Alright, for this preset is Rocket Tackle, Big Bang Kamehameha, Sonic Rush, Maximum Charge, Final Kamehameha. The reason why I have Final Kamehameha, because this is the full power of Super Sonic. And of course, regular Super Kamehameha. Force Shield and Super Saiyan as always. And the Super Soul for this is let's just enjoy the game right now. Which it blocks out all type of blindness and all stun moves I think. The one that blinds you and stuff. So that's why I have that on here because this is his full power at max. And this preset I would call it the melee preset. With the beta jersey or you should call it the Goku jacket because that's what this really looks like even I know it has the beta logo so for my 
um, melee um, preset for Classic Sonic, which is um, um, pressure, yeah, pressure sign, rocket tackle, and Super God Shock Flash. Those three are gonna be good for a certain amount of time that you're gonna use it for. And of course, maximum charge as always. Dragon Fist, because like I said, it's a strike preset and I was thinking over time skip over Dragon Fist, but I like Dragon Fist more because it kind of does more damage um, for wise of choice. And I picked Dark Rush Melee because it's a good ultimate to um, connect as well. And I picked Hyper Movement as an evasive. So if someone does an ult, Sonic can just um, use his evasive and break their stamina really quickly. And of course, Super Saiyan. And of course, my Super Soul I'm running this on is I'll Make You Regret That, which that is Kaba's Super Soul that increases your melee attacks extra large and boosts your normal attacks by large. And now we have um, normal classic Sonic again, but this one has, um, Super Vegeta's transformation, and this one has, um, Punisher Drive, Big Bang Kamehameha, Super God Shock Flash, and Maximum Charge, and this one has the one-handed Kamehameha Mach 2, which I know MK stands for Mach 2 for short, and we have Supernova Cooler, and the reason I have this preset that looks like um, the first one is because this one is just normal Sonic with Kaioken, and this one is the, um, this one right here is just the key build preset. Like I said with this one, this is a melee strike, um, preset, and this one's a key strike, uh, fuck, <laughs> key strike, <laughs> key supers, um, preset. And that's why I picked Super Vegeta. And of course, the Super Soul, this is a real Kamehameha for the Big Bang Kamehameha, so it can do more damage. And now, this preset, I would call it Future Super Sonic. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know I make this up, okay, because of Future Gohan and stuff. But anyways, I did name this Future Super Sonics, because why not? Because I don't have the Golden Saiyan armor yet from the Dragon Balls, because I was going to make it like, um... Excalibur Sonic from Sonic and the Black Knight because that's why I had it on Xenoverse um, 1 so I was thinking to have that in Xenoverse 2 but I guess I have to wait on that until I get the Dragon Balls again so this is what preset I have for this one is everyone lend me your energy which I could use Supernova Cooler or Kaba's Ultimate um, Impulse Slash that increases the damage of any ultimate temporarily medium and of course future super saiyan because um it's much faster and it doesn't have the um animation of you being stuck in it as well and of course super god fist times 10 kamehameha because this is the future version of it and die die missile barrage and now for hypersonic which I don't know if you guys know that Sonic did have a hyper transformation in the old classic game of Sonic 3 and Sonic 3 and Knuckles as well. If you collected the um, Super Chaos Emeralds in that game, Sonic had the ability to go Hyper Sonic, which it was really, really dope addition to the game because that's when they first did Super Emeralds and all that stuff. And the reason he's white because that's his high perform. I wish they did have a clothing that, you know, that looks like rainbow colors type of animation on the colors. That would be really, really good and amazing to have. So his attacks is um, Pressure Sign, Kamehameha, Super God Fist, of course, Maximum Charge, as always. Super Kamehameha, Perfect Kamehameha, Mach Dash, and of course, Potential Unleash. Because Potential Unleashed shows that nice glow when he goes hyper mode. And of course, same um, Z Soul as um, this preset right here. Everyone give you your um, energy, which will boost the ultimate attacks of Perfect and Super Kamehameha. And of course, the last one I told you guys about is Mystic Sonic, which he has Burst Rush, Burst Kamehameha. 
press that. I was gonna say press. <laughs> Pressure sign, maximum charge, super Kamehameha, darkness rush, melee, and hyper movement, and also potential unleash. So now, I wish I can show off all of these presets. Bleh. <laughs> I wish I could show you all these presets as possible, but we're gonna show most of them as I can. So we're gonna have, why not ultimate Gohan? Okay, let's get going. Ah, uh, you guys are thinking I could take this online. I really could. But I chose not to, to be honest. Let's take it to Capsule Court. All that talking wants me to drink water now. But I can't at this point because I'm testing this out. I guess Gohan is um, coming this way. So as you can see, I have more um, stamina and key, and also a green bar of health as well. Like I said, because I had like no health at all in my stats last time I did this. Cause last time I um, made my character, I didn't have nothing in health. Like it was like a certain amount of health. Okay, Gohan's giving me that key. Okay, Gohan, stop that. Alright. Do I have enough for potential unleash now? Let's charge up a bit. Alright, there we go. Nope. Take that back off. Oh, okay. Alright, for Gohan. Potential unleashed. Hmm. I really like this preset I have. Burst run of that. Not Burst Rush. Um, burst Kamehameha is a really good move to use. I'm glad I transferred that over. Even I know it was in the game, but still. I could have perfect blocked that. Alright, let's see if I can hit him with a Burst Rush. Come on, Gohan. I'm gonna pull off this Burst Rush. <sighs> I don't want to use precision slime. There we go. Now to actually do it like the show or not. That burst rush attack is really good. It really, really is good. Alright, let's try another character. This may be the longest video I've ever done, but who cares? Because I want to get this out of the way, because I don't want to forget, like I did to Zeteros 1, and that would be very disappointing. Alright, so I guess we could try, uh... Why not normal Sonic, why not? I guess we're gonna have him fight, uh... Someone we haven't used, um, what about Vegeta? Yeah, what about Vegeta? Hmm, I'm gonna have them fight at the mountains, why not? Oh, King Star is live streaming. That was 17 minutes ago. Yeah. Oh, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, I'm looking on my phone real quick because I saw a notification earlier before I started. Alright. Alright, so we're gonna fight Vegeta. And I realize Vegeta's aura changed. It's supposed to be blue, if I'm not mistaken. I think. Let me know in the comments below if Vegeta's aura is supposed to be red. I don't know. That that just looks familiar. It just I don't know. Cause I know other Vegeta's presets, um Um, they had um yellow and stuff. Okay. Can Sonic Rush actually connect? Oh, that would connect with Sonic Rush. I know Sonic Rush connects while it's down. Boom, 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 boom. Aww. Alright, let's go Kaioken. I was gonna make a Dark Sonic um, preset, but I was gonna wait until they give us the Super Black Kamehameha. Cause I really want that nice Super Black Kamehameha, yo. Who, who doesn't want that black Kamehameha? Alright, 
Hmm, how am I gonna finish Vegeta off? I would do time skip, but that's gonna take too long. Wow, I guess end it classic. <laughs> One Punch Man. <laughs> oh yeah, I have also seen a lot of people did One Punch Man, and some of them are actually good in Xenoverse too. Cause I've seen some people made um, Saitama and stuff around Xenoverse too, in the community on multi lobby. So I guess we could show off. Um, I guess two more presets, so I don't have to make this video so long. Um, I guess Hypersonic versus Goku Blue. Let's get this going. In space. <laughs> Space! No, I'm not starting it again. No, 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 no. I was about to say space from Blessed Portal 2, man. That core keep saying space and space and all that good stuff. Which I wish I never want to remember that. Super Godfist! Wow, that I, I can't believe Super Godfist actually connected that. Wow. Alright, get my key up and Goku grab me. At least at least I'm satisfied now that I'm in the green bar now. Of my health. So I don't have to die quickly because you see where my health bar is at right there? That's where that's where it was originally was at because I was like dying so quickly. Because my health was originally there and stuff. And it was just annoying. Like, for me, it was annoying, and so... Come on, Goku. I can't believe you ran into that. I wanna see if I can stamina break him. It isn't over yet. Come on, Goku, dash, please. And stamina break, sir, and super come in now. As you can see, that super soul is really, really good for any ultimate you use, even if it's strike, um, key blast, or even other ultimates. It's just, it's just that good to have on your character. All right, I guess I can show. Um, one more character. Um, mm, I guess we can show off the the melee build. Um, I guess we're gonna fight my my mentor. Who's my target? The the donut man. We're gonna fight my donut man, the mentor. It's time to make the donuts. I have to fight my mentor now. Jesus. Yes, Hit is my mentor for Xenoverse 2 for all classic Sonic because why not? I, I'm, I'm literally a big, well, I mean, I wouldn't say I'm a big um, Hit fan, but I just love using Hit because um, his combos are like um, easy, easy to understand if you know what you're doing. I could j Rocket Tackle is so good. I will keep saying it until it's known for its glory. Alright, let's see if we can go Super Saiyan 1 at least. Or Super Saiyan 2. Darkness! Oh! See if we can get enough key. Four, five, six, seven. And I got hit with time skip. Let's go super saiyan through. Just for fun. No! Come on, hit. Oh jeez. Come on, hit. Okay, hit. Always conserve that stamina. 
You don't want to waste your stamina so your opponent can stamina break you quickly. You always have to save your stamina. It's very important. If you don't do that, then you you, you really are screwed. Alright, I'm going to wait for Hit to get close to me. And this is game sir. In Darkness Melee is really, really good. Darkness Melee is really, really good. It, I recommend this for any Melee character. And I accidentally press retry. That's not what I wanted. <sighs> because we basically already showed off like all the presets I want to show you for Sonic. My main character in Xenoverse 2. But I am hyped for DLC Pack 2 whenever it drops. I hope it's like somewhere around the same day as um, Road to Boruto drop. Which I highly doubt they'll drop it there. Because it did says coming soon in 2017. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me showing um, my character Sonic the Hedgehog in Xenoverse 1 and 2's presets in general to see what you guys think about it and stuff. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope I see you guys next time. Don't forget to hit that like button really hard and comment down below what you think about this. And I'll see you guys in another video.